More news right here at 5 o'clock. LMPD released body camera video today after officers shot a man accused of a home invasion. It happened back in October. It comes 10 days after that incident happened in the early morning hours. The police department delivering on their promise regarding officer involved shootings. WHS 11's Ian Hardwit shows us the video. Put the gun on the ground. LMPD officers spend several minutes trying to tell the home invasion suspect Sylvester Price, who's wearing red plaid, to put down his gun. Price yells for help. He never releases the weapon. Hey, watch your muzzle! After moving from the backyard, Price begins to flee officers. They move down the street. Price faces them briefly with a gun. That's when four officers fire at Price. They shoot him, then immediately offer aid and move the man's gun away. Here's how the morning started. An automatic gunshot detection system shot spotter alerted police to the home invasion before a 911 call was made from inside the house. LMPD says the one man they shot is the only person involved in that crime. When officers arrived at the scene, Price was in the back of the house with a bloody hand calling for help. He didn't comply with their demands and went inside the home. Price is behind the glare and the glass sliding door and heads up the stairs. At the front of the house, officers announced their presence through a broken window. Saluda Metro Police Department! While the cops have the house surrounded, the sound of shattering glass comes from the side. Then Price moves to the neighbor's backyard. It's from there the police continue to tell him to put down his gun before the chase begins. LMPD provided still images of the body camera footage showing Price pointing the gun. Squad car video shows him turn around, pointed at officers, then turn around again, hands up briefly before they go back down. It's just a few seconds before they shoot him. More video shows the family leaving the house. Other pictures provided by the department show bullet holes in a child's bed inside. LMPD's Public Integrity Unit is investigating. Chief Jackie Gwynn Villaroyal says copies of the case will be provided once complete. A copy of the case is turned over to the Commonwealth's Attorney's Office for determination of final disposition. In Louisville, Ian Hardwick, WHAS 11, on your side. And the chief says LMPD has another 30 days to provide an update on the case. Uh, that's according to their internal investigation policy. The man who was shot, Sylvester, Sylvester Price, uh, survived. He is charged with burglary, wanton endangerment, and resisting arrest. Police say he's still in the hospital. Critical but stable condition.